Good morning, this is Peter Rogers with the National Weather Service in La Crosse, Wisconsin, with a severe weather briefing for Wednesday, April 19th, 2017. Today we are concerned about strong to severe storms and locally heavy rainfall possible late this afternoon and into this evening. Impacts could potentially include damage due to large hail and wind, isolated tornado, and even river and flash flooding from the heavy rainfall. Timing is from 5 until 11 p.m. late this afternoon into the evening. So there's really two different threats we're looking at for today. The first one on the left-hand side of the image is the severe potential. Severe thunderstorms are, the threat is highest for areas south of Interstate 90, where large hail and damaging wind are the primary threats. However, across the far south, mainly for areas south of Highway 18 across northeast Iowa and southwest Wisconsin, we could even see an isolated tornado. Now on the right-hand side of the image, we are concerned with locally heavy rainfall. Now most areas should pick up three quarters of an inch to an inch and a quarter, however locally we could see up to two to three inches, especially for areas that see repeating thunderstorms over the same area. Now these higher amounts could potentially produce localized flash flooding, although the location of that is uncertain at this time, and also river rises with some minor flooding possible. Now there is some uncertainty with today's forecast. The time of day has relatively high confidence again from late this afternoon to this evening from 5 to 11 p.m. However, the severe threat is dependent on the timing and location of a warm front that we're expecting to lift northward through the day and the available instability associated with that front. So the severe threat has a low to medium confidence level. The heavy rain flooding threat is also a low to medium confidence level dependent on where the storms form if we see and if we see repeating thunderstorms over the same area. Looking at that at a risk level, heavy rainfall and hail are our primary concerns for today, although damaging winds are possible and also that isolated tornado cannot be ruled out across the far southern areas. Let's take a look at some simulated radar that this is one potential way that the storms will evolve and develop throughout the day. This is not necessarily what will occur, but a good idea of what to be looking for. By noon today, not much is happening across our area, but as we move into mid-afternoon, a band of showers with embedded thunderstorms will likely come across our area. These are not expected to be severe, and they will quickly lift northward with time so that by early evening they should be north of our immediate area. Our bigger concern for the severe threat and the locally heavy rainfall then comes this evening as we see a rapid development of additional showers and thunderstorms as a cold front sweeps across the area and also a warm front lifts north into portions of northeast Iowa and southwest Wisconsin. And by midnight, all of those storms could potentially be out of our area. So in summary, we could see damage due to large hail and wind, cannot rule out that isolated tornado, and river and flash flooding is also possible due to locally heavy rain, although the locations of occurrence are somewhat uncertain. Timing from 5 to 11 p.m. And again, locations for the severe threat are mainly south of Interstate 90, and that heavy rainfall threat is somewhat uncertain and something we will need to be refined throughout the day. Thank you for your attention. If you have any questions, please visit our website or interact with us through social media. Please be weather aware today. Thank you.